just to see if I lose my mind. Wait, is this like the is this the last curse or the first? What? You said you have nothing left. So so what were the other ones? What are the other ways that God tested you, Joe? My entire life of Dota 2. <laughs> he sent you Quinn. He made me play in North America. That was yeah, that was it. That was it. The point, okay, the, this is not the point of the story. The point of this story is I hate this hero. And Kid track. that's gonna be a first blood. I don't know how he managed to aggro the tower, but Mira immediately takes advantage of it. A lot of magic resist you can build, so he's a late game scaler. That's how I'm viewing this hero more, and that means it shifts even more onto collapse here. What the hell is going on, mid? He's mean? 23 and 10. Yeah. I'm telling you, Hawk doesn't win lanes. He, has, he doesn't have the base damage to compete. What a low skill dog shit play that was to fake out the enemy team with doppelganger. Yes. The highest Isn't skill, right the highest skill play you'll see pro players make with this hero is to not move. <laughs> That's right, Austin. <laughs> and he pulled it off. He did not move for five seconds. Oh, yo, Pasha's oh. having such a good game too. But oh, Team Spirit brought four heroes to the mix, and they're not going to get him, but they're also going to get Sableite as well. The Goblin does not have level six, so no swap available there. Ding. No. What is going on? Dude, I'm right about it. You're just looking up the wrong stuff. <laughs> this is why we need AI. Aggressive play. Spear him easy. with the coil on him. Nice little combo that secures the enemy carry kill. Tri Cruise Cup is a part of esports themed carnival held on the no, Sapphire it's not Prince the Cruise Cup, Cruise man. <laughs> Arena to catch it too, and Yatoro's here to clean up. The Clockwork Goblin plays another foe. What is happening in this game right now? I don't know. So Shop of Fire just losing arrows all over the map despite the healthy lead they have, despite that great move. Yatoro barely lives. Oh. It all maybe could have been all right if Yopach actually managed to kill Yotaro again. Gets his uh, Timber Chain canceled there by God's Rebuke. And now the Clockwork's on top dead of him, too. so he's dead as well. Well, well. That was just effectively a team wipe. Uh, yeah, he had a losing spot. Now who's... I don't think you just made up this turn. Reestablish something. And you're looking for this butterfly timing on the Terrorway because, of course, this is the biggest power spike in this carry to carry matchup. So you really need to get that butterfly and make some objectives happen with it. Go Posh fishing. They're gonna chase. Jumps the orb, does manage to get the blink away before the Stampede hits the butt. Saberlight was on the other side. Oh, the wall blocked him out. He was gonna hit the blast off, but Dio Lacour ends up inside of the arena, therefore doesn't land, doesn't get the stun, misses out on the kill. And now they dove into the tier three, which Team Spear, they're gonna try and take advantage of with Mira. Oh, coming in from behind, and Yotaro's back, and he wants some revenge. Spear into the bench, does manage to hit the stomp immediately onto the Phantom Lens here, but he's in fits already. He immediately managed to get rid of that threat. He has starts throwing some uh, lances around. They burnt out Yopaj. Yopaj is totally out of mana here. Does have soul rank to work with though. Oh, he trapped himself. Oh, collapsed himself in the trees. We've established that the tournament I knew existed existed. Thank you, Austin. This is, I'm sure what the viewers came here for. Big smoke from Team Spirit as Austin continues to do his research. What do I have to Google? Everything for you. Laps looking for the jump. He finds our team with the man to dodge. Damn, he's good. Look shot back in. They want to keep playing this one out. That looks dangerous, but the clockwork somehow stays alive. Kills the Elecor. Okay, now he's going to die to reflection. Arteezy is getting burned out of mana. He's in trouble. He's blasted by the finger of dead just like that. Saberlight is no mana either, so he's stuck as well. A full turnaround from Team Spirit is in force now. So even as Was Arteezy on that team? No. Yes, he was. There you go, oh, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, the arena saves him. Once again, the blast off cannot land. They're stuck oh. in this arena with the hook shot. Let to go to the two of our heroes with the cogs. Garena combo with a pinball inside the pit. And Shopify. Oh, they're going to receive a faulty for this one. Is Oh, RTZ gets off a of Sunder, but who the hell cares? He used what? it on an illusion. Oh, the man to dodge on the ledge. All right, calm down. <laughs> 
<laughs> his signature move. His signature. Toro was not ready for his signature move. Monster kill. Clean up kit track. Four man wipe as they got the centaur as well on the chase down. Okay, found attack. something. I don't think you want to hard commit on this. Poke no, it. certainly not. Going in. Look at this. Oh my god. How much damage did he take already? Jeez, they had to swap him out there. That means Kitrax on the front lines with Collapse inside the arena, so he's already dead. Collapse. They're running forward, looking for more. They know the Centaur is dead. Can he find Arteezy? Arteezy? BKB Sunders? Not the blink, though. Can he fight through this? Can he TP out? Can he do anything? The arena is going to be a problem. He's stuck inside the arena and he's dead. He is done for in this fight. Mira comes in with a hook shot and an ally. What a great play from him. <laughs> sure, yeah, yeah. I think Mars is, is number one. Like, I would be happy picking Mars into any of these other. I think he reliably does way too much. His lane is reliably just as good. And he has so many builds that you can play and scale into. Just fits into any draft. Well, that's gonna run straight into the enemy. Oh An arena Lord. on four, on spear, on two, a second what arena, a this? second spear. Collapse has got them in a Venn diagram of hell. Oh my god. Collapse with the most giga chat play I've seen in years. That was literally just 1v5. <laughs> Three and a half minutes on the Aegis. Shopify. Surely in shambles after that last situation. I think they've been in shambles for a while, to be honest. Yeah. It started long before that fight. Strength blink for the Mars. He's got a DD on him? Oh, oh boy. Oh boy. Somebody got to die. <laughs> Running out though. He'll not get the value. He's gonna play it safe. Missed the hook shot, but got the kill anyway. Laurel just just killed the enemy carry. Blink game is over. I mean, you can fight this out as much as you want, but there's no way they're going to be able to do the damage without the Terra Blade. Yutoro gets a little bit low. Remember, he has the extra life. Oh, doppelganger just before that magic missile lands. Yopaj and Saberliner tanky. And Yatoro, maybe he's gonna get forced back here. Again, you can just die whatever you want. He's got the extra life. Ah, collapse, goes straight to the back line, gets them all inside the arena, spears up before he even hits the wall. The bench is already dead. Timbersock gets cleaned up, leading Saberlight for last. A 2-0 cleanup. Team Spirit, man. Well, I owe you a lot of money. Good thing you did not accept that bet, though. As everybody heard, you did not accept that. That clock did not find the multiple cogs, but you didn't need to because Collapse just arenaed their entire bye team bye. every single fight. <laughs>